Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Godly. I don't know if y'all have seen this video floating around as far as <laughs> shit talking to the UMG Atlanta. I am fucking dying over this shit. I just find it absolutely hilarious. As always, somebody's got a bitch complain, moan, and groan about something. So anyways, it kind of raises the question, um, how much is too much? Do you agree with shit talking while you play? Like I said, in my mind, I'm assuming that each individual that I come in contact with, even if they sound like a fucking scrub or a squeaker, in my mind, I'm convinced that they are at least 17 years of age because that is the age to be playing this game. So in my mind, I'm assuming this and I go for it. I don't care. Balls to the wall. No holds bar. I don't give a fuck. You want to act like an adult, play like an adult. Play an adult game. I'm going to treat you like an adult. So anyways, this fucking video, I'm going to leave the link in the description below. It's fucking hilarious. And I probably watched it probably 10 times. But, you know, how much is too much? What's too far? Do you agree or disagree with shit talking when it comes to MLG advance? Now, for me, of course, if you've ever played with me, without a doubt, I'm constantly bitching, constantly shit talking. That's just me. That's my thing. I don't understand how an individual can sit here and play this game, especially Black Ops 2 with all the bullshit lag, just fucking whack shit i don't see how somebody can actually sit there and not shit talk it i mean i don't know i guess it doesn't even matter because even if it wasn't black ops 2 i would still be talking shit if i get my ass whooped i talk shit if i win i get you know i talk shit it just it doesn't matter with me i'm just always ready i'm just ready at any point for somebody to pop off now it brings up the question though as far as professionalism you know do you consider this unprofessional what do you really consider unprofessional when it comes to fucking gaming? It's just funny that this is even a fucking issue, but whatever. Like I said, for me, I like to talk shit. I don't care. I like to get amped up. But then again, I kind of stuck under pressure. So, you know, but I'm definitely one of those people that I don't talk shit unless I know I can back it up. I don't talk shit until after I've proved, you know, my skills or proved what I can do. So, anyways, with this kid on this fucking video, I mean, it was like fucking Ric Flair Jr. Woo! It just fucking drives me nuts. This kid was fucking amped up. He was fucking pumped. Now, I don't necessarily agree that it was the time or the place, but I don't know. Just for individuals to sit there or a team to sit there and not get amped up, not talk shit, like, I can't, I can't understand that. That just isn't me. I... Don't know. You know, like I've said before, I had looked into getting into a couple of clans. And one of the things was, is my language. I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, a lot of clans don't accept shit talking. And so, needless to say, I'm a free agent. Hit me up. But anyways, <laughs> you know, um, like I said, a lot of clans don't accept people who like to talk shit or stir shit up. So, how far is too far? For me, like, it might have been taken too far just because it was like at an MLG event. But if you've just been randomly sitting there, you know, like just on Xbox Live, what have you, whatever, I'm always down. Like, I'm always ready to talk shit. I don't know that this was the time or the place. But like I said, a lot of clans don't even take people who talk shit or who like to stir shit up. You know, I mean, they don't want people in there that's going to be consistently stirring shit or starting shit. I get that. I totally get that. But for me, I think it's more passionate than anything. I don't understand the fact that people could sit there and not talk shit, you know? And with these individuals, like, they talk shit and they fucking backed it up. That's my thing. If you're going to fucking talk it, make sure that you can back it up. And they did. As far as talking shit to the crowd and stuff, no, nah, I'm just not into that. I'm just, I don't know. I, that just isn't for me. But... I don't know. I don't think there needs to be fucking rules and all this other shit. Because when you start incorporating all that shit, it kind of takes the fun out of it. And like I said, for somebody to sit there and not get amped up, not get fucking pumped or be passionate about it. Like, what's the fucking fun in that? Now, I don't really think this Ric Flair Jr. motherfucker, woo, needs to be all doing all that shit. But like, I don't know. I don't even see how his fucking teammates could fucking concentrate. I, you know, like I said, for me, I got to have like a chill mood and stuff. I got to fucking work myself up. I don't need somebody fucking hollering in my ear and all kinds of shit. I ain't down, you know, I ain't down really with the drama. I just, I don't know, just kind of sit there and chill. Like, if you want to talk shit, fucking talk shit, but don't bring me into it. You know, you going to get your ass whooped, you take your ass whooped, but don't bring me into it. But anyway, so like I said, I don't really think that, you know, it was unprofessional. I don't know. 
when he turned his shit to the crowd, I kind of, like, that's just not for me. Like, why bring the crowd into it? I don't know if it, you know, boosts his ego a little bit more. I don't know. Like, I don't know. But for there to be fucking rules and all this other shit, like, it just, it takes away from it. You know? And like I said, I talk shit on a daily basis. I don't care. But I make sure that I can back it up. But to be unprofessional, I don't know. I don't think that that was the time or the place. I really don't because it's a fucking MLG event, you know, and then start throwing this shit in like, well, we make more money. What? No, shut the fuck up. Like, I ain't trying to hear all that. You know, I kind of think it was unprofessional um, whenever he turned it to the crowd, you know, to the fans. But just one on one. Nah, it's good fucking fun. Just chill the fuck out. As always, everybody's fucking oversensitive and comparing dick sizes, this, that, and the other. So, anyways, that's what I got for you guys. Till next time, peace out.